it's, it's the one philosophy and it's, there, is, there is a story behind naming the device or naming the family at least to see one where it's one we always looking for the one I want the device that helps me to do many things I need that one I need that particular device that does everything for me in only one device so before I go and show you more details about the product I'd like to, to show you a review video about the product and We'll take it from there. Talk about it into detail. I mean, if you if you if you paid attention to the last last clip of the video, that talks about amazing camera and authentic sound. And this is where actually HTC One comes and stands out against any other smartphone in the market with this with these two areas with amazing camera and authentic sound. So talking about HTC as a device, talking about uh, HTC One X as, as, as a device that we, 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 we are about to launch, it's going to be available this week. I'm sure you guys are aware of something called H uh, HTC Sense, where it's our key differentiator against any other product in the market. I'm not talking with an Android platform or with any other platform, it's across all platforms. So Sense, it's not only a user interface or graphical user interface where we make life much easier for the user and how to create folders, how to customize the menus, how to have widgets. Uh, having said that, we are actually to see as the second largest manufacturer when it comes to widgets after Google. So we are actually one of the heaviest developers when it comes to widgets and, and Google development in that, in that area. But since full, I mean, brings a lot of good stuff to us for the HTC One X. With, I mean, if you look at if you look at the camera and if you look at the specs of the camera, first of all, uh, you're talking about the flash. The flash is adjustable up to five, up to five levels. So whatever you're shooting, you can, regardless of the distance and the focal length, the, 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 the flash adjusts. Plus, you have the best lens in the market, which is. 2.0 aperture lens that never been on a mobile phone before. I mean, if you if you remember uh, other technologies from other manufacturers talking about 2.4 aperture or whatever sensor or whatever, nobody came up with something like close to 2.0 as an aperture for the lens. Aperture for the lens basically it's how the lens can be light and absorb more light. That means I can have 44% more light in a low light condition. I'm not talking about no light condition, I'm talking about low light condition. So a lot of pictures that you might be taking but the flash doesn't help you because you're taking like a landscape scene or whatever. So you have the best uh, uh, lens ever. Media Link basically it's not DNA, it's not HDMI, it's HDMI cable. It's actually a merge between these two. Uh, it's an HDMI cable, but connects wirelessly to your device. I have connected the dongle in here. It's basically a dongle. You connect it by HDMI port. So the TV has to have an HDMI port, and that's it. It hasn't been. It shouldn't be uh, an HDMI DNA enabled. It shouldn't be a smart TV, whatever. With less than 500 dirhams, you can turn your normal TV to a smart TV. Why? Because you can you connect it, you you stream whatever you want, not only multimedia content, you stream PowerPoint presentations, you stream instructions, you stream whatever you want with a direct Wi-Fi technology through the media, <coughs> which is now connected to your TV. And the best thing ever, you have a dual screen mode. Dual screen mode basically. If you're streaming an onboard video which was downloaded with your device, you're streaming it on TV and and for some reason they want to check your email, so you can do that. So you stream the video on the device and check your Facebook, your email, you do whatever you want on the device. So this is, this is the dual uh, link.